So we've got the new hardware offering in from Scantac. This is the Nimble Track, the latest in the TrackScan series of scanners. Uh, and we're really excited to get into it. I've got it all uh, right here on the table. And so we're going to open this case up and just take a look at it. A little bit about the device. It is the first uh, all wireless metrology grade blue laser scanner on the market. Uh, the first by Scantec too. Everything you need is all in this one case. If you're familiar with the other track scans, they are usually, uh, there are two cases, one for the tracker, one for the scanner. So yeah, everything's in here. Um, the main parts of the hardware are the tracker. So that's this guy. Uh, two cameras, and then all the electronics, battery slots, so it can be wireless, and then tripod mount there on the bottom. And here's the other main part of it, the scanner. Uh, again, we've got a battery door kind of right here where I'm holding it. Uh, we've got some buttons here on the back. You can hit with your thumb, trigger button for turning on and off those lasers, cameras, laser emitters, and then your target fixtures all over this thing. Something interesting to note about this, it's a one-piece carbon fiber frame. Uh, that's new in this this line for the track scan series. It's be really awesome for rigidity and just makes this a lot more robust of a piece of hardware. Everything else in here, just other stuff you need to get scanning. Uh, markers, which you don't need often. You've got your 12 millimeter markers for if you want to do your dynamic tracking uh, or your super coordinate conversion, which we'll get into. We've also got the wireless router. So that's how all this works wirelessly. Everything connects up to a wireless router, and then it's streaming data over to your PC. I've also got these uh, the USB. These are look familiar if you're used to other Scantech scanners. I've got a silver USB drive that's got my hardware uh, ins or software installation and a blue security dongle for that said software. Some batteries here. Uh, these are the tracker. I'm sorry, these scanner batteries. Let's go in the handle. I'll throw one of those in there. This guy just pops in this battery door there's a battery Put that in there awesome and then the trackers batteries look like this uh, these are all just like off the shelf these are camera batteries and these are i think they're flashlight batteries so they're you can just get them on amazon uh, instead of having to get uh, specific ones for the oem Got some cables in here too. I won't actually pull those out right now because you don't need those by default. So that's those. There's two cables in here: one for the tracker, one for the scanner, and then those both plug into this box. And this box also gets a power supply and has a USB cable for going to your PC if you want to plug all this up in wired mode, which is the kind of secondary mode for this. It's ten, intended to be all wireless all the time. We've also got the tripod. Super lightweight little carbon fiber tripod for the tracker. And then calibration equipment. So here's the calibration board for the scanner itself. It's got the big targets on there so the tracker can watch it and then the little targets to calibrate the cameras and the lasers on the scanner itself. And then lastly, the calibration bar for the tracker. Again, carbon fiber bar with these targets on it, uh, an array of different targets. You put this in different areas that the tracker can see and it's able to calibrate that. So that's everything you need for scanning. 